In 2017, the executive director of Golden Gate Audubon Society saw her vision become reality when two Osprey cams in Richmond, California were launched to the public. With sweeping vistas of San Francisco and the Bay Area, it was hoped the cameras would engage a large number of people, not just avian scientists and bird lovers, but also people who hadn't given ospreys living in the Bay Area much thought. From the outset, the cameras were meant to inspire learning and motivate people to help the birds thrive by making the bay's watersheds and shoreline environment clean and safe. Five years later, the San Francisco Bay Osprey nest cams have succeeded beyond all expectation. With over 100,000 unique views on the website the first year alone, 4,500 Facebook fans, over 750 YouTube subscribers, as well as hundreds of dedicated enthusiasts on the innovative live chat, Osprey's Rosie and her endearingly quirky mate Richmond have inspired a love and devotion to Ospreys that has been expressed through song, poetry, paintings, memes, quilts, t-shirt fundraisers, and more. That reach has spread worldwide with viewers from Europe, Thailand, China, South America, and throughout the United States. The city of Richmond even declared the osprey its official bird in 2018. How was this dedicated following accomplished? A well-crafted website focuses attention first and foremost on the two nest cams. One aimed at the nest, the other positioned at the far end of the World War II era whirly crane aiming at the nest and the industrial neighborhood in which it is located. Visitors are invited to engage personally with conservation efforts or via the live chat. Questions are answered on the extensive FAQ and video archives of meaningful moments are accessible at the click of a button. The Osprey Cam community was further engaged when a fish counting program was introduced in 2018. See a fish? Be the first to call it on the live chat page, and your chat name goes down in the permanent database as the one who first called the fish. Invaluable for both research and educators, as well as grad students studying birds of prey, the fish matrix continues to be an engaging venue for connecting with others. Besides, being able to confidently state that an osprey family of five consumes over 700 fish in a season, or that you know that the ospreys are flying six miles for trout stocked in the local reservoir, can be highly entertaining. The nest cams also provide views of a variety of other birds, including ravens, gulls, Eurasian collared doves, peregrine falcons, finches, starlings, yellow-rumped warblers, and many others. In addition, viewers learn about the ravaging effects of fishing line on bird populations, and how trash along the shorelines is often brought to the osprey nest, resulting in potential danger to both adults and nestlings. Where do we hope to go from here? Eventually, through banding each cohort, we hope to learn the migration patterns and survival rates of the local osprey population. And we hope that those who hadn't ever thought about how their party balloons or discarded trash might impact the lives of these magnificent raptors decide to join the next shoreline cleanup program. And we hope Rosie and Richmond have long, healthy lives to help educate all their adoring fans.